Uh, I'm Eugene Lasansky with OLLI at Eckerd College, and it's my honor and a privilege to welcome the director of OLLI at Eckerd College, Mary Zaralita, to our program today. Welcome, Mary. Good to see you. Thanks, Eugene. It's good to see you, too. Tell us a little bit, since last time we've talked, this format was almost a year ago. Where are we with uh, programming at OLLI? Are we in person? We're back in person. Are we still doing virtual programming as well? We are. And as I think I might have mentioned before, uh, we plan on keeping Zoom, I think, uh, for, for a good while. Uh, it, it seems to appeal to some of our audience, we do see quite a few members that are from out of state who are zooming in. In fact, I just had a conversation the other day with somebody in Washington who loves our classes on Florida um, and our arts programs. So she's just so grateful that she gets to zoom in with us. Uh, otherwise, she wouldn't be able to. So yes. And the E-Class Pass, that's still an incredible bargain. I realized that it's uh, for members $75 now, and there are about 60 different classes available. Well, so um, for, yeah, if you get both passes to cover four months of our term, winter term, you, you'll probably get about 50 to 70 classes, depending on the, the term. Uh, and then you get access to all those Zoom classes. So it is a great deal. Uh, any given week, I've I send out the schedule to those pass holders and I'll see, you know, between five to 10 classes in a week where normally that person might spend $10 a session. So you think what, $50, $70 a week, they're getting a whole term or, or two months worth of, of classes for that $75. So it is a good deal. And a good number of those classes are actually offered as recordings later. So if something comes up and you can't connect on Zoom that day, you've got another appointment, you could actually watch it at your leisure. Is that still going on? Yes. In fact, uh, I just got back from uh, uh, Explore Florida Keys trip with some members, and they were telling me they were getting the links to the recording. So they were going to watch it when they get, either got back to their hotel room um, or when they got back into town. So it is a great feature. We are very uh, appreciative whenever our instructors do give us permission to record. Um, and, and so it, it, it gives them an opportunity. If you have a doctor's appointment or, or a meeting comes up, you can uh, watch it again later. And back on campus, uh, I've been back on campus two or three times so far. There are some classes that are going on, and it's such a it's such a joy to be back in the classroom. Is that going to continue and expand? There are going to be more and more in person classes. Yes, and and we hear from the college that there's going to be some more updates on the COVID protocols and guidelines, especially as we start to see those percentages, those numbers of cases come down. Um, I, I think we're still going to need to have masks on in the classroom for a while, but as far as like the dining option, uh, whereas right now it's a grab and go, we might start to see some of that indoor dining coming back in a limited capacity. And I know our members really miss that, uh, that option. And, and I miss seeing it. I would walk into, I remember, you know, 2020 walking in and, and seeing large groups of OLLI members share and, and conversation and lunch and I think those are going to be back soon. So. It's, a, it's a wonderful part of the program. Talk a little bit about our new venue. Um, Ruth Eckerd Hall is, uh, is now holding some classes for Ollie. The, the, and what, what are we doing at Ruth Eckerd Hall? That's so exciting. Well, we are very excited about this new partnership with Ruth Eckerd Hall and their education department there. Uh, they have opened up their space, their Murray Theater. In fact, I'm share a nice little picture while I talk about uh, our partnership. Hopefully everyone can see that. Can you see that, Eugene? I can. Great. Um, so, so we've uh, partnered with Ruth Eckerd and what's great about it is we share some of the, some of the same history or we have the same donor, Jack Eckerd, uh, who supported both our college and the arts. And so that's why you see the name Eckerd in both of our organizations. Uh, and they have some fantastic space uh, at their facility, including ample parking. Uh, and so last Thursday, we had our first two classes on site there. The picture you're seeing here is with uh, a Rick Kistner, a history on, I think this was the Jackie Robinson uh, class that he presented last Thursday. He has another one coming up next, uh, next week uh, in March. And so, uh, 
great stadium seating, very comfortable space. Uh, I heard the acoustics was really good. Um, and, and so it was kind of like our own little corner for Ollie program. Yes, actually, that's my head in the lower left. And it, it really is a, a beautiful space. And I understand there's going to be some programming that, that kind of fits in with the, uh, the Marsha Hoffman uh, School for the Arts, which is there, I believe, uh, an improv class, which is an intriguing opportunity for a select few who are interested in, in risking that. Yeah, I mean, that's the other great thing about this partnership is they have access to teaching artists who teach programs there, uh, you know, throughout the year. And so we're going to get to share in, with those teaching artists some of the programs. And I, yes, we have an introduction to drawing class by one of their art instructors, um, an introduction to improv. Uh, so very, very much looking forward to uh, hearing about that class. Uh, and then a singing along group. So they're going to go through the history of song. And then I, I'm pretty sure have their own little uh, singing group uh, going while they're, they're in class. And I think that's a four session. That's wonderful. It sounds like out of the pandemic is coming uh, new opportunities. Obviously, the, the technological uh, amazement of being able to zoom in from anywhere that you are and watch programs uh, recorded or live. And hopefully at some point we'll be getting back closer to what we used to call normal. Yeah, and well, and I forgot to mention, we also have our Metropolitan Opera programs that have come back. So we're going to, we have, we just presented one in January and we're going to have five more. So we're going to have six out of the 10 in the 21, 22 season. So yes, things are slowly coming back. Um, and I'm very excited to see our members coming back on campus. As, as well as some safe social activities. I believe we're still doing some of the, the beach walks. And I believe there is a group that, that meets and walks through different county parks as well. Yes. And, and that, that was another you know, silver lining out of the, the whole pandemic is that it brought about new programming that we didn't have pre-COVID. And so our social committee has really done an amazing job in creating, developing new programs that are outside um, and together. So we have, of course, the North County group is focusing on our fantastic Pinellas Parks. Um, so they go every Monday at 9 a.m. and they share their pictures, their finds. It's a really a great group. And I think it's becoming a very close knit group as well as our beach walks. And so that's in South County. They meet every Thursday morning at 830 uh, and, and take, you know, take their walks along the beach and at different paces. So it's, it's been a great, uh, I think, a great outcome of, of this pandemic, as well as we're seeing trivia groups come up, you know, and, and enjoy time outdoors at, at uh, local facilities. So, yeah, I think it's all good. It's really a wonderful opportunity for, for us to get back together and continue the kind of enrichment that, that Ali has made available to, um, you know, all of us here in Pinellas County. I just want to thank you, Mary Zeralita, for stopping by and, and giving us a little bit of an update. We've got a lot to look forward to and a lot that's exciting and new that's going on now. Thank you, Eugene. Appreciate it. You're welcome.